Well, what is up, y'all? And welcome or welcome back to another reaction video. No, because baby, look, why Miss Natalie be eating? Because, yay! I run my city from the west side, big to best. I do a day to shite. Queen Louisiana, Dr. Dre, the Los Angeles. This is it, bitch. Michael Misfit. Hot huh? day, a legend and moonwalk. Sliding across the stage in 87. This that Tupac out the window. Both hands throwing up that middle finger. Fuck them other niggas, ratchet bitches. And my demons, yeah, I'm queen. What is up, y'all, and welcome or welcome back to another reaction video. I'm your host with the most, Natalie Love, here to give you your committed commentary on these here videos. Now, before we get started, to all the newcomers, well, hey, welcome. We're so glad to have you, and we hope that we can keep you, but quick disclaimer. I cuss, I curse as I do all the things, okay? I got a foul, filthy fucking mouth, and it's just something that, it, it just happens. All right, it just happens. Um, these are reaction videos. Uh, so I'm going to react. That means constant pauses, frequent chatter during the video, whatever. However I see fit, bitch, a 15-minute video could be an hour long if I got that much to say, okay? If that's going to move you to words, allow me to let you know right now, this is going to be exposing cheating girlfriend for scamming three men out of money. This is a loyalty test, okay? Y'all know we like these over here on this channel. And if you did not know, we like these over here on this channel, all right? Uh, if you still here under the sound of my voice, given all the shit I already told you going to happen, let me have you do three things for me, and they all free. Like the video. Why? Because it helps us grow. Comment to let the love gang know that you subscribe to the channel. And if you see this or this, that's the emoji. If you see that, that lets you know we got the how here with us. Okay? They not flipping you off in the comments. They not flipping me off, child. This is the symbol. All right? That's to let you know you're a part of the love gang. You got the how here with you. Okay? So if you're a part of the love gang, go ahead on and comment it. Throw your pistols however you want to do it. Okay, with that being said, I'm going to make sure we record like we always do. And I ain't set up nothing, so I'm going to pause y'all real quick, set it up, and come on right back. And just like that, we back like we never left. Okay, so let me go ahead now and make sure we record like we always do. Bow and let's go. Uh-uh, where is the sound at? Where is the sound at? You, 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 you sick. You're right sick. Now. You're uh, sick. Oh, okay, because I was just going to say, excuse me. You let me know, is there any, like, limits? Like, is there things that you excuse don't want me to do? Me. You know what I mean? You can do whatever. I just want to see how far she's willing to go. Oh, I like when they sound like that. He got dick. What's going on, YouTube, man? It's your boy, Solo J from the A-Man. We're back with another episode of Catching Solo's Cheaters. For those of you who are new, this is a series of videos where people reach out to me in order to test their partner's loyalty. Usually when we do these tests, we actually don't know if the partner is cheating on them. However, in this I think test, they get on my nerves with this cheating. music. That's not even the catch. We found out crazy information on this girl during our investigation. I don't be knowing about this music. Shot. This is going to shed light to a lot of situations that happen every single day in Atlanta. And I really wanted to spread awareness to you guys because this situation can happen to you oh, as well. Okay. So without further ado, <laughs> you guys to because it's thrilling. Before we get into this video, uh -uh. I want to make a few of you guys who wanted to make an extra uh -uh. $150. Uh-uh, uh-uh, let me get past the solicitation. Let me get past the solicitation. How long? How long? Because I don't, okay. First of all, we've been together for like um, a year now and stuff like that. And, you know, when I met her, I hate your you know, line. I felt like it was, she was really different. Her name's Ashley, by the way. She was really uh, different. How um, old is she her, and how I, old I, is I he? Shit. She's like, she was different. She gave me some type of good vibe. She gave you a and, mother you know, vibe. Um, I don't know. It was just a, when I first met her, I felt something. You know, you know when you feel why something. Why did they both look? Why does he look like a child? Like, Sometimes I could be over exaggerated, but it could be. It could he be like, love, like, yeah, real, like, a real type of love. You just never he looked get that dry. Like, it was like love at first sight. I mean, you know, love at first God sight is probably, me. but I feel like maybe like that first week we kept talking, I feel like I fell in love with her. You know, love at first like, sight is what? Like, what's I mean, this? What's wrong with the neck of your shirt? The fact that I try, kept trying to like get into her, talk to her a little bit more, try to hang out with her a little bit more, her the vibe okay. we were getting, it was just. Okay, I mean, all of this is cool and good. I can kind of see why. Okay, you ain't got to look like where you at. And I don't know that man business, but like, you know how you just see somebody, you look at them and be like, they look like they stink. Shit, like the collar of this shirt is pissing me off because it looks like literally Sub-Zero grabbed you by the neck of that shirt. Come here, get over here. That's what that looked like around this area of your collar. 
okay? And I don't know if any elderly people raise you because his jean jacket and his pants is real big. So I feel like his parents may have been brought up in the 90s. This is bothering me, though. And then you left out the house like this. Why is there three different goddamn hairstyles here? You have a fade right here. You have a boosy cut, a high top. Is that a rubber band? Like put in the line of demarcation between the fro and the boosy fade? I don't really know. You don't get enough sleep word about this bitch. You don't get enough sleep word about this bitch. Okay. And a little bit of lotion. Do you just fine? I ain't even gonna say the young man got something wrong with. Look, listen at my phone. Hey, yeah, uh, hey, shit, boy. Everything don't respect my motherfucking artistry. You know what God's plan? Let's continue. Let's continue. She told me she was a um a virgin, right? So I was like, you know, I'm respect that. Oh, like he's so, sweet. Um, I was her. She, you know, I was her you first. Thought? Um person that she you know she did let's with thumb this up and, um, y'all fellas you know, I, fellas I like stop believing happy, that you know, all the time some time to just you know tell my family some bitches like don't count some really, niggas really serve somebody stop you know, always but it, it's ways like you can that. tell so, ask your um, dad one day i went to my family ask your mom and everybody was there i show i finally showed her off and stuff like that and you know I hold on because i keep rocking my mom was happy people were happy then my uncle came up to me okay i got to elaborate on that real quick when when i say that it, it's a certain way when 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 you actually take a, a bitch virginity that like you it's a certain way she act with you huh and it take her years to stop acting that way hmm it don't just go away all right so if if this the state she have you looking in because a, a bitch will give you her all Okay, and, and sometimes you can be given the bare minimum. And that bitch will give you every drop of her. Ain't no way in hell somebody giving every drop of them to him. Okay, because cause I would never allow Mike. I, I'm going to have to tell, baby, baby. Because at the end of the day, I'm a representation of you just like you're a representation of me. You you got to show gratitude in your attitude. Okay, and, and, and that is equal in sometimes your appearance as well. Okay, so just be on the lookout for stuff like that. Women act a certain way with you when you be the first. Go, go ahead, go ahead, babe. Go ahead. He, you know, I hate the fact that he's a like sweet that. dude, though. That's he like seemed that. like he's a sweet dude. Nah, there's no way. You know. Uh, really, a commercial right now already? Come on, Walking Dead. Walking Dead still on. My God, Dead City. Lord, they done learned how to live in the dead shit. Okay. I need to get back into Walking Dead. But you know, the world we're living right now, that's... that's, that's the the thing I, I hate the most but like, about it is I nice guys to, finish last. You know, and he, he seems sweet. He said, we don't um, know he shit. The picture, yeah. right? He put me to the side. Because last time uh, I told Savannah, I he was a good little, man. Yeah, and he was literally her, her he dependent. He's a security guard and he met her from there. So he's a security guard? Yeah, Where's he a security guard at? Um, I think some some big lounge. He need a little stick of gum. He just brushed his teeth and left the house. That's why his mouth white. I be having that happen to me too. At a strip club. Yeah. Damn. Listen, put about another twenty pounds on him. Feed him real good. Situation. Yeah, we can call him. Get him some kind of nourishment to vibrant up that skin. He ain't no bad looking dude. Take a sponge to the top of his head. Put a little leave-in conditioner in it. Love on that man. Why this lady finna be sleeping with this boy uncle hey, and I'm up, guessing? Um, he basically um, give me a rundown, tell him like, you know, what I went through and tell me like what my girl did and stuff like that. Where you met. As you can see, Christoph's uncle. So died. it ended there, Unc. It ended there. like y'all didn't know each other. Y'all didn't know of each other. You knew of each other. Cause, 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 like he looked like he'd been dealing with this girl long enough to have taken it, taken a yearbook picture around the time they was together. Like he, he looked real adolescent in them, in them, in them photos. So you didn't know that this was his woman. 
Like she wrong as hell for, for, for biting onto the bait, but you literally casted the line. So you want me to believe that it ended there. Okay. Let's, let's continue. Okay. Um, actually confirmed to us that Ashley is not really who she says she Most is. Most people aren't. What's even more crazy is the fact that she's been hiding this from Kristoff for a whole year. Mm. Even though you guys kind of already know the outcome. Damn, the his look, the, his look done evolved like that in a year. Story actually gets ten times crazier than we actually. Did. That nigga got the Benjamin <laughs> Button disease or something. Yeah, up, when you get here, come down the ramp, and we're gonna be right here in the parking lot. Chris. See you. Right now, this is approximately three days from the day. Okay. Yeah. Within the past three days between today, we had Kristoff's uncle reach out to Ashley to set up an expensive dinner date. At this point, we know for sure that the uncle was telling the truth based on how easy it was for him to set up this date. So at this point, we were already ready to expose him. His uncle looked like a dog ass nigga. Point, like, she has a oh, no, he got a little eczema. I can tell by his hairline. It, it hurts, man. It, it's tough. Man. Oh. Just, yeah. It's gonna be hard to see how this is gonna follow through if it if it's. Um, I hope, I'm hoping she just. Yeah, he got eczema. You know, I'm holding out hope. Love that man through that eczema. Who my uncle say it is, but because I put, I put my, all my baskets into that that relationship. You put all your eggs I, into that relationship. I'm gonna be real with you. I really. You don't shouldn't understand do that. Why she would go on a date with a guy that like while well, she has a boyfriend, you know? Yeah. And I think that. I like, don't really trust life. your I uncle though. Hope that. She might just be wanting to get something to eat. Or Plot something. twist. Her and her uncle end up together. So I don't trust your uncle. She told me she was going off with girlfriends, too, so. I don't even know how to feel about this loyalty test. I just feel like this one is probably one of the craziest ones I've done so far on my channel. Really hope for the best, but um, I got to offer him if the girl ends up cheating, then I'll give him an offer to make seven hundred. So uh, you guys stay tuned. We can see if um, this works out. What's going on, Nancy? What's up? Um, is she, um... I'm gonna give him an offer to make $750 like if she fuck up. Why don't you just give him the 750 and you yeah, make it for him? Hey! <laughs> yeah, put on three ways. Right, like... I'm gonna mute it and stuff like that so I can hear what's going like on. Like, you and your uncle... You, you, your girlfriend and your uncle just talk like that? Right, it's muted. Mm -hmm. it's muted. And it's because he been setting her up? Okay. Oh, boy. I, she's already talking to your uncle, baby. What What more? Loyalty test over. She's already allowing your uncle to take her to dinner. As ready as I'm going to get. <laughs> How long is it going to take you to get ready? Are you dressed already? I'm dressed already. Oh, okay, okay. Bitch, stay ready to eat. I'm, I'm, I'm going to pick you up in about an hour. I'm going to call you when I'm outside. All right, I'll see you soon. Loyalty test over. What? Like she's a dirty bitch. Loyalty test over. He really looks like a zombie in the face. Somebody need to love him. You've already crossed the limits. What are you talking I, about? Uh, not real. I have to know what's, what, what she's really about. Man. This is what I need to know. You know, what, what break me is going to make me stronger. So uh, you can do whatever. I just want to see how far she's going. Judging from the elasticity of your skin, you're not that strong already, baby. Let that goddamn serpent slide. I don't, I don't, everybody be wanting the truth until the truth staring you in your face. Somebody put that down in the comments. And that, and that can't rain more goddamn true. And even if these situations are sometimes made up or exaggerated, these are still situations nonetheless that do happen in real time. I don't know if it's just a part. I'm I'm very much so in love with me. Okay. If something don't make me feel good or if I feel eerie about something, I can't just sit up and pretend like I don't see it and go along to get along with a situation. I'm not going to do it. I'm going to address that shit. We can either come to a common ground or let's step the fuck off. I don't need to inquire or include a third party at all to let me know what my what I've already been feeling. I can't stand a person, oh, I'm going to call such and such. They can tell you, nigga, them your partners. Bitch, them your partners. And even if, what the fuck do I look like? I don't even know this person to trust or believe this person. Family included. I don't even know this person to trust or believe this person. So you getting another person involved ain't going to do a goddamn thing for how the fuck I feel. I feel this way about you, not them.
And if they can tell me something and convince me that you're telling the fucking truth, you need to be concerned about me and them. Hmm? Because what the fuck has built the trust between you two motherfuckers where I'm not allowed? I don't fit there. I have to get this person to validate my truth to the person that I'm with. They're supposed to trust me. Does that make sense? Am, am I missing something? Am I speaking over anybody's head? I know everybody not going to get it, but some people are going to get it. Shit like this would not fly with me. If I heard Mike on, my on a motherfucking phone call talking to one of my aunts, if I found out that she even got his motherfucking number and it wasn't about a surprise party, it wasn't about no gathering, and better yet, he got that bitch number and didn't say nothing to me, we have a problem. There has to, especially in a club setting, what made you approach this woman? You just all of a sudden wanted to test her fucking loyalty as his uncle instead of trying to convince him, hey, this may not be the bitch for you and here's why. You obviously are keeping in contact with this woman. Okay. I'm going I'm to let it go. I'm going to let it play for a minute. I'm going to go. I'm going to try. Okay, cool. Say less, nephew. I got you. We, we about to expose her right now. Yeah, definitely, man. Send me a location. We I don't have time for games like uh, this. Might be her. I'm not going to contact cheaters and shit. I love to watch it. I'm not going to contact nobody to, to further my embarrassment. Yeah, no. No, that's that bullshit, but you're breaking my heart. Our mission in Coding Dojo is for redefining You're breaking my heart, not theirs. What the fuck do I need a goddamn entourage and an audience for? But everybody loves to watch a fucking train wreck. You, what the fuck is happening here? Y'all hold on, my God. All right, y'all, we back. Shit. Computer, and kept doing it too. Let me go ahead and make sure we recording. Bow. Now let's go. Yeah, definitely, man. Send me location. We on the way. Uh, might be her. I don't know where they from, but I like their accent. He's a little, I find her because he's picked by pick her up. That's where she. They gotta be from the East yeah, Coast. Her apartment. Yeah. Oh no! Why is Amazon paying me twenty thousand dollars? Come on, man! Y'all gotta be kidding with the fucking ads. They gonna force me to get YouTube, uh, whatever the fuck the shit is, to stop all these ads. Guys, we were ready to meet Ashley at her apartment. In the interview, Kristoff stated that he has been paying her rent for the last couple months. He also stated that he received a key. He might be Haitian. His name is Kristoff. Since we have a key to the apartment and we already know that she's cheating, the plan was to bust into the apartment and expose her. However, things You don't need to bust in the shit. She fucking with your uncle. Yeah, I don't even lie. This is um it's kind of different. This is not where her crib is at, you know. This is somewhere in the city. It's just kind of weird. This is this is not where her crib is at at all. What? Nah, it's, it's not. Oh, it's, it's a whole that's not area. where the crib at that you know wait, 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 of. Wait, wait, wait. In the city. wait, she doesn't live in the city? No, she lives around the outskirts of, of um, Atlanta and stuff like that. So, wait. Know, she told me she's home, but this is her location that the uncle sent me. It's a, she's she's, she's at home. Of, you ain't never seen know, her somewhere home. Somewhere in the city. I don't know what the fuck. It's not showing me exactly what it is, but it's just showing me. A city area, which is weird. I love how so he speaks. Where did she tell you she was at? She said she's old. She said she's at. He speaks real eloquently. Before, I story, like it's it. It's ten times crazier than we initially thought. Prior to the uncle picking up Ashley, we did have Ashley send him. And his he got location. so much potential. When a current location is sent, you don't get the exact address to where you're going. However, before the test even started, Ashley told Kristoff that she was at home. So me and Kristoff are thinking that we are going to be picking her up from her house. However, as we continued to follow the location. It took us to a hotel. The question right now isn't just why is she at the hotel? It's who is she at the hotel with? Okay, so I'm lost because ain't the uncle supposed to be y'all ain't this is a hotel. Y'all ain't gonna bust her out? Yes, this is a hotel, bro. What the I'm not gonna lie. This is a hotel, bro. You can't like, lie. If it's a or hotel, it's a hotel. This might be an apartment, or uh, I don't, I don't, I don't. This know. is I never, I never been, been here before. I never. She wasn't intending on you to be there now. Hotel. Can you call Uncle? Yeah, I'm gonna call him right now. Not Uncle. You already here? Yeah, I just pulled in. I just pulled in, nephew. Hey, Uncle, don't don't tell her you're here yet. You hear me? Don't tell her. That, you say don't tell her that I'm here yet. Yeah, do do not tell her you're you're here yet. So look, 
What's gonna happen is what his life Jean is looking at. Um, just bring her straight to your car. I know she's prepared to go on a date right now. Right, right. So make sure you don't leave. Like no matter how she keeps pressing you to go on a date, if she asks you about the date, try to stall I, so we can get the information out of her. I don't so like that Michael see. Jordan hoop in his nose. Hey, Ashley. What you smiling for? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you ready? Um, give me like five minutes. How far are you away? I'm about like two minutes. Two minutes away. Okay, that's good. Yeah, just um, let me know when you guys at. All right, got it. Cool. So, um, we, we have everything set up now. You can go where. Add her to the car. Right? So she the at a hotel. I'm calling in there. He got suitcases in the back. Okay. Hello. Hey, sweetheart, I just pulled up. You ready? Um, yeah, I'm coming out right now. All right, cool. I don't understand how they have all them car lights on. I look at cars that got them lights on like that. So I... I, it was some. Some would be in me to just look over, like. Always. <clears throat> oh yeah. <laughs> Girl, you can stop laughing. He ain't in the car yet. She got a big forehead. I know that bitch trash. Coming from a bitch with a big forehead. Nice and comfortable. Yes, sir. Ski. Well, you probably gotta put the seat up a little bit. It's kind of laying back. Unless that's comfortable. I'm so glad you put that. On. Are you? I had to see you looking all good and shit. Oh my gosh, you know I really look good. Wait a minute. Okay. Okay. Are we done with the bullshit now? I only look good for you. You want to believe that they never had previous encounter? Come on, man. You know I try. You know he getting me thick. <laughs> How? Oh my goodness. How he getting you thick? Got the taste for. You know I do got a spot in mind, but you know. Mm, what you got in mind? Probably like this this steakhouse joint that's like like you know, the, they've been dating a year. Yeah, she, she, don't she don't know that this your uncle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, I have met all of Mike's like uncles, so I don't, don't know. So I don't know that life. I guess some you people don't meet the uncles. As you should. I hope you do. I definitely know what you like. You look so good. I try, you know. I try. You know, I gotta look good for you too. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yes, yes. I'm really just happy that you came because loyalty test over. I've been really down. I've been going through a lot of stuff in my life. Oh, yeah. Yeah, life been really. Bitch, I'm trying to feed you. I don't want. Yeah, I'm not your therapist. Now. Um. Feed fuck. That's all I'm trying my to do. My rent is Double coming F. up, and I don't think I'm going to be able to make rent. I'm probably going to need a band. Gonna need a band. Yeah. What like like the drum and shit? Hey! Stop your oh. money. <laughs> oh, you seen the band? Yeah. Oh. Making no, the band. Making a thousand dollars. Thousand dollars. Are you gonna be able to help me? Help you well. At this point, as you guys can see, this is the part of the video where things start to get weird. For one, Ashley is at some random person's hotel for no reason. No, it ain't no fucking reason. At this point, why she's at this hotel. For two, she's begging Kristoff's uncle for money. And she's just bubbly as hell. Like, why are you so bubbly and going? Uh-huh. I really think that Ashley is just tricky. That too. But it's something you know else. Baby, what is wrong? It is something else to that. No, no, I'm not believing she just tricking with the uncle. Because what you mean, you Ain't getting the working? thing? No, you know that. This y'all first oh, meal? Man. Give it back. So I, don't, I don't know if I got that on me right now. What you mean you don't got it? Yeah, I don't think I got it on me right now. What the now. fuck? Look, mean, what do a band look like? Like band somebody band just band look like a band? No, you got stuff going on. I know you got it too. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, please, you know I'm worth it. So you know you he got motion. Yes. Mm, I'm worth it all. You? you know I'm very worth it. Mm. Why you know that? I hear that. How you know that? I hear that. How you know? Man, it sounds nice though, yeah. So who's that that's calling you so much? You asking me who's calling me like I just didn't ask you for help. I know that's like, right, bitch. Get to it. Purse first. <laughs> My is doing two days. Mm. Purse first. Mm. You don't care about me having a roof over my head for real? 
Man, don't, don't, don't look at it like that. Don't take it like How that. How am I supposed to take it? Like I was just taking you your know, ass to get something to eat, bitch. You know, no understanding. You know, I told you, you know, I don't got it right now. Maybe the person that's calling you Understanding so much, about what, but you have the audacity to ask me who's calling me is crazy. You know, because maybe they could help you out with the rent. Right. You should that's be answering every call. That's really how you feel is... <laughs> I mean, you're not understanding my she situation. She said purse first. Man. I can't knock her hustle. I just told you. I don't got it right now. Look, they still calling me. Let's just get this food, you know what I'm saying? Maybe it's something, you know. Is she finna turn down, down the meal? No, 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 no. 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 How about, how about, how about, how about, how about. What is going on? Uh, what the fuck is going on right a now? Lot of, a lot of gang really? shit. Really? We mean serious. What is wrong with you? you That's my fucking uncle. Are you serious? Like, are you, don't you start smiling. Yo, no, stop playing with me, bro. Like, stop playing with me, Ashley. You, you, you got these cameras all in front of me. This is some real Because look at you. 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 I take you out to eat. I take you out of my family. Are you serious? No, look at you. You look stupid. You look stupid. You look stupid. stupid. Are you serious? She looks like a Cambodian grandmother with the pants on. I take you out to eat. I pay, I, I pay for your rent last month. You, talk, you talking about you, you want rent for him? Are you serious? I paid your rent last month. Yes. You can't do that shit to me. I almost hit my car. What are you talking okay. about? Wait a minute. Girl. What do you mean you, you almost hit, hit my, my car? Oh, I was supposed That's to miss. Ooh. You, ooh, you, you, you sick. You're right sick. Now. You're She's fucking sick. She's not sick. She broke. You are, you are sick. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck me? Yeah, fuck you. I put everything into you for a whole f year. I should be the one embarrassed. Aww, you can't say you're embarrassed. Are you serious? serious? Are you you serious? Are 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 you